Hello. No, the Longhorn isn't for sale, but good lord, isn't that a long Longhorn? <laughs> God damn. Do not. Ooh. Anyway, <laughs> it's a client of mine. Uh, he's going to sell these bulls. Last year, he used all these bulls on cows, but then he got hooked up with me, and I started selling them, obviously, last summer and last fall and this spring, or this winter, and pretty much out of cows now. <laughs> so uh, he said, let's sell some cows. I sold pretty much everything. So he has a bunch of good young bulls. Obviously, didn't have many cows around, so didn't have this, this many bulls. Most of the young bulls, most of Charlotte's come from Thomas Charlotte. Um, Mitch Thomas down there in the valley, Raymondville, he breeds some stout, big ass, big footed, just good using bulls. Uh, they're ranching, I mean, they're ranching bulls. I mean, they may not be able to pet them, may not take them to the county fair. Sometimes little, they, they, as you say, they pay attention. But I promise you, those Thomas bulls are the toughest damn bulls you ever want to use. Uh, a lot of these bulls were bought last year. Yearlings turned out bred. I mean, all these bulls were on cows, so do the math. We have 30 bulls. 30 cows a bull, so I hit a lick there last year in selling his cows, but wish we had them back now. The market's so darn high. Also some nice Brangus bulls in the offering as well. All these bulls are young. The Brangus are young, the Charlets are young. And trust me, a lot of these, these bulls are Thomas Charlet bulls. They're bought as yearlings last year in, in the sale they had in the spring in Raymondville. You will love the KS studies, Thomas Charlotte Bulls. They know how to put pounds on the ground. Uh, good stout bulls. I mean, mm. I always say, give me nuts, guts, and butts, and let's see what happens in these bulls. They'll have nuts, guts, and butts. Also, some nice Brangus bulls. The Charlotte Bulls are men now. Woo! We got third book, ass on him. Mm. And some of these bulls are three-year-olds, but a lot of them are just coming twos, you know. I don't have enough video footage to really appreciate these bulls. Figured a little video footage of these bulls. I'll have more video footage on YouTube, but I'll send this out via text. Most of these Charlet bulls are Thomas Charlet bulls. Miss Thomas down the valley, he's been raising, raising good, powerful, using bulls, you know. So, I mean, again, these cow bulls are raised in brush country. We turn these bulls, they're just two-year-olds now and already bred lots of cattle last year. So nice stout Charlet bulls, deep rib, just good using bulls. Most of them are coming twos, some coming threes. The bull right in the middle, he's only 18 months old. So these bulls already have been used. The uh, reason we have them, they all use them on cows. Uh, I had a... <laughs> He asked me to sell a few cows for him. Pretty much sold every cow for him. <laughs> wish, had, wish we had the cows back now, but oh well. We did okay in the fall. Wish we had them back now. <laughs> nice Brangus bulls as well. Some of these Brangus bulls are more just your, your heifer type we raised here on the ranch. And some like the bull in the middle there forming kind of Brangus bull. And these bulls have been turned out, you know, the bulls that are twos were turned out as 13, 14. All these bulls are 13, 14 months have been turned out. So they're, and that bull there is a four year old bull. Some are older, but most of these bulls are just coming two and three year olds. Of course, they're bringing all these bringing to just yearly bulls. Nice group of using bulls. Again, most of these are Charlets. Handful of nice of bringing it's some Jersey cows. Anyway. Nice bulls that will make you money. You know I am playing the hobbits. Again, primarily these bulls are Thomas Charlet bulls from Raymondville, Texas. These bulls turned out, can cover lots of cattle, and raise huge ass calves. Have a good day. Ooh, wider screen, he's so damn big. Have a good day.